In our first video, we went over how to build a schedule from scratch. Now we want to show you how you can use an existing Microsoft project schedule or a P6 schedule to import into Pro Planner and to start using our platform from there. So again, once you're in this new project, you've got the ability to import a new schedule or build it from scratch. I want to select import my schedule. From here, I get to choose if it's a Microsoft project file or P6. I'm going to hit Microsoft project. I'm going to select the schedule that I want to import from here. It will take a few seconds to upload. Now it's going to take me through everything that it's finding. So from here, I can see the activities I found, any calendars, if there's progress, if I have anything like labor hours, cost or resources. If I click through next, it's going to take me to an overview of everything it found. I can turn these on and off. And for today, I want to bring in my activities, my calendar, and my progress. If I hit import, it's going to take a couple seconds here. It's going to upload. And then I just exit out of this window. And in just a few moments, our master schedule is going to be imported into Pro Planner and allow us to start working. From here, you want to be sure and just go through your project, see if everything's looking correct. If you have any issues, you can always hit this little help chat in the bottom right corner. One of us will always help you out. But as you can see, this came in very smoothly. We can see all the details, links between activities, predecessors and successors, durations, activities, and so on and so forth. Furthermore, if you wanted to import a new schedule over an existing schedule, you have the ability to do that from this screen. Maybe you've built a new schedule. Maybe you're importing a new update. What you can always do is up in your menu above the Gantt, we have our import and download options. If I click there, I can select import new schedule and then you'll receive this warning sign. It says, please type in the word import and that will allow you to authorize the import of a new schedule. Please note that's going to delete all of your current activities. And if you have a look ahead schedule connected to this schedule, it's also going to delete that. So I warn you, be careful when you do this. We can always work with you to, to talk about other ways. You can update your schedule, keep your look ahead, and so on and so forth. Thanks.